Imagine landing a plane that is bigger than the runway. That's what happened in 1963, when the U.S. Navy wanted to test the feasibility of landing the massive C-130 Hercules with a wingspan of 132 feet on the tiny deck of the USS Forrestal, an aircraft carrier. The mission was crucial, as the Navy needed a way to transport large amounts of supplies and personnel to remote locations where conventional planes could not reach. The pilot chosen for this daring feat was Lieutenant James Flatley III, a veteran aviator who was not a afraid of a challenge. He and his crew trained hard, practicing 100 landings at a simulated carrier strip. Then they headed to the Atlantic Ocean, where the USS Forrestal awaited them. The conditions were not ideal, as the wind was blowing at 50 miles per hour with gusts up to 60 knots. But Flatley was determined to make history. He and his co-pilot managed to land the Hercules on the carrier 42 times, 21 of them with full stop, and 29 with touch and go. They proved that the impossible was possible.